harassed in their own home. A mid-state couple says after they fell for a phone scam last month, they thought that would be the end of it. But as News Channel 5's Jason Lamb tells us, that couple says the calls they're getting from scammers still won't let up, and now they're getting aggressive. You'd think someone calling to scam a couple in Middle Tennessee would know better than to try Lawrence Morris. I was with the Tennessee Capitol Police downtown, which was a, a division of the Highway Patrol. But even he and his wife Ingrid couldn't escape the calls, which started last month. You're collecting a lot of money. That is the reason why. She told me that, uh, you know, you uh, won some money last year and you uh, never uh, uh, Claimed it. claimed it. And I said, I don't know. But when they started, former lawman Lawrence knew he could break out his iPad and hit record. That's all recordings of, of them calling us. Lawrence and Ingrid Morris figured out it was a scam, but not before even they were duped, sending away $300 of their own money. They don't care about uh, how the old uh, older folks pay for their uh, medicines and food and uh, everything else. But now the couple faces another problem, the calls. I just wish they'd stop. Keep coming. Uh, they started getting nasty. But this is what you guys really want. Do you guys don't want the money, the award prize? But just to remind you this, Ms. Ingrid Morris, uh, without my signature, things were not going to happen. So for I now, Lawrence says he'll continue looking for a way to stop these, even though he says he'll likely have to deal with all this again tomorrow. I will calling. Uh, turn this over to a federal law enforcement agency and Jason Lamb, News Channel 5.